But first tonight, Baltimore City's mayor and hospitals are bracing for a winter COVID-19 surge worse than we've ever seen. This is something they held a news conference today to address the drastic increase in cases and those going to the hospital. WMAR 2 News' Abby Isaacs joins us tonight from City Hall with an update. Abby. The mayor didn't institute any major restrictions. Instead, he and representatives from hospital systems all across the city are asking people to step up and do their own part to stop the spread. Let me be very clear. We are experiencing high community transmission. Mayor Brandon Scott is worried, anticipating a winter surge with an increase in hospitalizations as Omicron spreads quicker and faster than the Delta variant. Because of Maryland Department of Health's data breach, they have limited data on what's happening in Baltimore City specifically, but they say they've seen as much as a 300% increase in COVID patients in hospitals, which hospital leaders say is preventable. 97% of COVID-19 hospitalizations within our health system had not received the three vaccinations needed to assure adequate protection. Hospitals are taxed not only because of the increase in COVID patients, but they have less people on the front lines because of a staffing shortage and increase in workers testing positive. At a high rate uh, for Johns Hopkins Health System, we saw 23 uh, uh, employees testing positive a day. Now we're seeing a high of 63. As it is limiting our ability to care for many other illnesses and surgical problems too, from broken bones to asthma, to heart problems. So today, city officials and hospital leaders are asking for help. Since the beginning of the pandemic, our health care providers have been seen as heroes. Now we need the community to be our heroes. They're asking people to get vaccinated and boosted, wear masks, avoid large crowds, and get tested. While testing demand is still exceeding supply, the city health department is expanding it to Mondays and looking for more sites and kits. We are uh, looking how to procure more of the at-home tests for folks outside of what the state is allowing us. One restriction the mayor did put in place. He suspended all Baltimore City Rec and Parks run sports programming through the end of January. In Baltimore, Abby Isaacs, WMAR 2 News.